Anyway, um, I must tell you that uh, it has been an awfully pleasant week so far. I know the week is short, but it has been uh, very liberating. The entire Infinity Management, that means Tom Chipasano, has uh, been in... Um, all of them have gone to this uh, management meeting. Cancun, I think. Cancun. Yeah. All upper management guys, all the sales guys, everyone piles out and goes to Cancun for a manager's meeting. And believe me, it should be longer. Oh, it is so pleasant without that guy around bothering me and checking up on me. And Did he give you a lecture him. before he left? No. We were fighting before he left. Because he called me in to give me a lecture. Oh, yeah? Well, you know why he calls you in now? Why? Because I'm unavailable. <laughs> See what you've done to me? Yeah, well, you got to make yourself unavailable. That's my Listen, I'm on your side. Make yourself unavailable to that nut. Well, how was I supposed to know? It was uh, by surprise. I was about to walk out the door. You tell him I'm busy. I tried. I said, Tom, I have no time. I'm very busy. And he said it'll take two seconds. Yeah. Well, let me tell you something. Hey, I heard a funny thing about the manager's meeting that... The funniest manager mm -hmm. wins a prize. Did you hear about this? The funniest? So, to, did, I heard this, Jack. I heard Tom came to you and asked you to write him some jokes. Yeah, God, he just asked for some suggestions. Yeah, how come you didn't tell me that? That's funny. Tom asked you for jokes? He has the nerve to ask you for jokes? You know, I never think of anything connected with Tom being funny. I didn't think, I didn't think of it as funny. Oh, it's funny when the general manager comes to you and says, would you write me some jokes? I want to be the funniest he didn't general say, manager. He write me some jokes. He just kind of was Did being silly. He said, oh, yeah. Well, he didn't explain it was a whole contest. He said, oh, we're supposed to say something funny and uh, do you have a joke? Uh, yeah. <laughs> what you was the joke? Did you give him a joke? I don't even remember. What did I? I, I just told him something. I told oh, him, were you drinking at the time? No, I just said something. <laughs> Did you black him, out? Him and Frank Flores, I just told him, you know, uh, I don't even remember. I don't even remember. But you, you didn't write that, any material for Tom so he could be the funniest manager? Well, the, a higher up in the company came up to me and said that the same thing, that they were uh, going down there and they were supposed to all do something funny, which at that point I started to realize that they were all supposed to do it. And as I went to say something to him... How's Tom? That's put so much pressure on Tom. Tom would actually have to have a creative thought. Oh, I know, I know. But Bucky came walking up and then the higher up said, now I can't uh, have you give me anything because everybody there will know that I got it from you. Mm -hmm. So I just gave him one of my stupid joke in the boxes to the higher up and he took that with him i don't know sounds wacky down there tom that Cusano. doesn't sound much like uh work to me yeah that's some work down there they're managers either they wear costumes or they yeah they always do something yeah. sounds like a party a three-day party it is without wives that's the other big thing just men just guys bonding bonding and being in cancun there's no women in management in this. No, company? I don't think it is just men, isn't it? Well, there's some female managers, managers but there's not, you know. But there's no spouses. Right? Yeah, and they're not a pain in the ass. <laughs> uh, what what no does alcohol. that mean? You know, they don't really interfere in activities. <laughs> no alcohol. Oh, what do you mean no alcohol? Forbidden. Are you crazy? Forbidden. Yeah, forbidden there's for five no minutes water. What in you the morning about? while they pray. <laughs> there's no water allowed. <laughs> But they're down there at this big management meeting, and they have a management meeting every day to discuss problems. I hear the big problem they're discussing is what to do about the grease man. Oh, really? Yeah, that's the big problem. Dude, that's the big problem down there. No one wants to tell me about this stuff because I'll go on the air with it, so I have to hear it surreptitiously. Grease man, they're down there discussing you. Oh, Jesus, my ears were ringing. <laughs> <laughs> no one knows what to do with you. You can't get any ratings. I don't know what to do with myself. Bang. Nobody likes you. Yeah, well, ratings hemorrhages aren't pretty. Pretty, pretty. <laughs> Are you still playing music? Yeah, a little tune, a little topicality, a little, 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 little Nobody knows what to do with him. Nobody knows what to do with the grease man. Is that what they yeah, did in Washington, just make him shut up and play music? Yeah, well, well, they invested so much money in this guy because... I can't be shut up. I have important things to say, like waddle daddle. Yeah, they brought him into the company to keep me under control in case I yeah. threaten to leave. They can put him on in the morning. Right. Except he's insurance policy. Yeah, except he's not working out exactly. <laughs> waddle daddle. He's not exactly winning anyone over. What, with gobble gobble? Yeah. <laughs> So he was the big plan. He was the big master plan. So now they have him on at night, and he keeps losing so many ratings for the station. Yeah, I hear he's destroying stations, as a matter of fact. Yeah, that he's, yes, station, <laughs> he's destroying, not the I'm other the stations, our station. I'm the Terminator. <laughs> yeah, I'm the ter he's working for the other stations, by the way. Terminate your programming faster than you can say, fee fi fo fire my ass, you morons. Yeah. <laughs> so there's a big, there's a big, big, big 
<laughs> meeting to sit there and figure out what to do with the guy. Yeah, yeah. Could you imagine a whole meeting discussing how to get rid of you? Yeah, yeah. How should we get rid of you? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I don't know why people don't like you. That's very entertaining to me. I don't know why. That yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's really. If, if we had known that that was the theme of the meeting, and then yeah. they came to us for jokes. Now that would have been funny. Have written jokes about that. <laughs> yeah. that been funny. That's not comedy. <laughs> Yeah. Well, the singing is how Tom is the guy who pushed the grease man on the company. Yeah. Tom. <laughs> Tom's the guy who came up with that gem. He doesn't think that's funny. I think this guy, grease man, is funny. I go, Tom, that guy has never been funny. He's very talented. He's very, t you're talented and he's talented. I go, okay, I know exactly what this is. You guys are just trying to get me crazy. You're going to hand him syndication. I had to fight you guys tooth and nail for syndication. And you're going to hand it to him. Okay. So hand it to him. And yeah, you're going to get me crazy. And when he fails, let me see what you're going to do with that big contract you paid him. Dicks. Waddle daddle. Waddle daddle my ass. Gibble gabble. Gibble gabble my ass. Gabble gabble. <laughs> hey, Tom, I got a joke for you. Why did the grease man cross the road? Why? Why? To try to be as funny as a chicken, <laughs> which he hasn't been able to do yet. <laughs> I'm sick of everybody. I'm sick of everyone. I'm sick of everything. Whole friggin' meeting. Guys trying to be funny for a prize. <laughs> what kind of thing is that? What is this, Amway? Yeah. <laughs> Drunk with ties. Jackie, can you write me a joke so I'm funny? I never. I want to win the prize. I have to win. And I, who is the judge? I've never been funny before. <laughs> it would be exciting to be considered funny. Oh, we gotta get tape of that. I know. Someone you ought to have tape any that. Any suggestions for me? Hmm? Yeah, yeah. Hey, Jackie, you have any suggestions for me to be funny at the manager's meeting? Yeah, go uh, trade in your personality. <laughs> yeah, get a brain transplant. Be someone else. <laughs> yeah. No, no, really. <laughs> yeah, no. What should I do? What do you say when Tom comes up to you and says he wants he wants you to write material for him? I actually laughed in his face. Yeah, I mean, come on, it's like, like yeah, like why don't you get, like why don't you ask me to jump off the Brooklyn Bridge? That would be easier. <laughs> that might be a task I can handle. Like a paraplegic asking you to make him up a gymnastic routine. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's funny. Wait, Let me write that down. <laughs> you mean you think Tom listens to the show every day? See, so would have written something down and just repeated it. No, no, nothing that original. Waddle doddle. That's good. <laughs> yeah, listen that to the grease man. Write that down. Required thought. <laughs> Big meeting about the grease man. Imagine all those brains down there. Trying... Yeah, that costs a lot of money. Yeah. To think about the grease man. Yeah. What do we do? We got a one. We got less than a one last last rating period. <laughs> what do we do? Station's crying the blues. We got a mess on our hands. Us. We got a mess on our hands. <laughs> and nobody wants to give them up because they paid so much money for them. Yeah. They don't want them to walk away a millionaire and not have them performed. It's sort of like one of those ball players who yeah. gets to the team, signs <laughs> a big contract, then doesn't do anything. Yeah, can't get a hit. <laughs> so it's a big problem. I have a lot of faith in him. And in the, Thank you, Tommy. And in the station, <laughs> and in the station that we compete with in Los Angeles, they thought they were going to be slick and hire him fast. And Andy Bloom said to me, "I'm not hiring the grease man." He goes, "I'm, I'm fine with you just working here on our station." So our station, KLOS, that competes with us in Los Angeles, the one that has Mark and Idiot on there. They hired him for nights, and now they had to cut him back to an hour. So they're paying him a fortune oh, for, just an hour's worth for an hour's worth of work. Oh, Jesus, they're throwing me around like a stick of dynamite. Yeah, <laughs> 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 I'm a hot potato. Yes, 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 yes. Is that yes, sir, or yes, 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 yes? Because it's the all new Grease Man show. <laughs> Lose some ratings for you. Yeah. I had a whole big argument going here. They wanted to run Grease Man promos during my show. I know. And I wouldn't allow it. In fact, they wanted you to promote him yeah. live. Yeah. So I said, no, I'm not going to have any of that. And then whenever we do Best Up or we go away on vacation, they mm -hmm. slip in Grease Man commercials. Yeah. Did you notice that? Like Tom Tom and his little game plan. Right. He'll change have the world. Grease Man promo. Every once in a while, they try to slip him in. You know, they'll have a promo for the whole station, and he'll waddle-doddle. Yeah, waddle-doddle. Love me, love me, love me, love me. 
Love me, please. Love me. Love me. It's really helping. <laughs> <laughs> so now they're going to have to go down and figure out what to do. So they're thinking, like, well, if they have a Greaseman play a lot of music, you'll hardly know he's there. Yeah, well, that's what they did in Washington. Yeah, and that worked. They covered him up. Yeah, that helped a little. <laughs> <laughs> so maybe that's what they'll do here. But that's, that's an awful lot of money to pay for a record spinner. Yeah. That's why they're doing comedy, because the subject of the meeting is so depressing. Yeah. Well, anyone there is funnier than the Grease Man. <laughs> yeah, maybe they're, they're hoping to find a replacement, and one of the managers will be <laughs> well, real funny. Maybe that's the contest. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> that's the prize. Oh, I don't know. Hey, they're all bowing in front of a big tiki on that island. <laughs> yeah. What do we do? What do, what do we do? What do we do about the Grease Man? What do we do? Grease Man, say something funny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a good-looking guy. All right, that's funny. Yeah, she Tom, nah. Tom says, I'm no fan of Mexico. <laughs> Is that what he said to you? Yeah. I'm no fan of Mexico. <laughs> no fan of him. Yeah. Why is he no fan of Mexico? I'm well, getting... no fan. Sure, it's fun, but... I'm no fan of Mexico. Yeah, it must be the line he's feeding to his wife. <laughs> That's what I do whenever I have to go away. Oh, I hate going away without you. Uh, Try to have a good time, huh? Yeah, I don't know. I'm miserable. I'm miserable. Just so I get down there. <laughs> 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 yeah, that's right. He's poking one of those uh, yeah, pinatas. Right. Yeah, he's yeah. got a hat on. Yeah, he's got a hat. He's lit to the sky. <laughs> And Doesn't then you get on the phone. Doesn't know his own name anymore. Just to leave the hotel and yeah. pull home. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hello, honey. I am no fan of Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> I'm no fan of Mexico. <laughs> Sure. Sure, you're no fan. Until I heard Cancun, is it? Yes, it's beautiful. No, I'm no, no fan. fan. <laughs> Not when I'm here without you, my love. <laughs> here it's fun. It's not it's romantic. Work, but it's. Fun. Fun. <laughs> uh, oh, there's a grown-up bikini. Gotta go. <laughs> I gotta go. <laughs> Bad water. There's nothing to drink mm. but booze. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm miserable. <laughs> Yeah, we can't figure out what to do with the grease, man. It's a big problem, and they're all blaming me. <laughs> no wonder he was regretting it. Yeah, he's no fan of Mexico, especially when the topic is what to do about the grease man and the guy who brought him to the company. <laughs> now I understand everything. Remember when they first brought the grease man here, Tom's running around the station, he says to me, you know, we were friends. We worked together back in North Carolina. I have been a fan of his since... Florida. Yeah, and now, and now, yeah, that's what it was. That was the big thing. I have been a fan of his since Jacksonville. I tried to hire him where I was. I now it's like thought he was funny. Yeah, now you go to Tom and you bring up the name, and he's like, um, I never said that. Uh, <laughs> he is one of the funniest guys. Yeah. No, because he used to say, I find you funny, and I find him funny. Now he goes, you're much funnier. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, you're the funniest. You're the funniest. He's very funny, too. Yeah. Oh, well, must be the one guy listening. <laughs> I don't know. He makes me laugh. <laughs> <laughs> the monotone. For you, Tom. Waddle Duddle. There you go. <laughs> 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 yeah. <laughs> Christian, make Tom laugh. <laughs> teeter totter, teeter totter. <laughs> <laughs> so there you go. Jack and Bill went up the hill to fetch a pair. Of Mingus. <laughs> Mingus. <laughs> Mingus. <laughs> Say waddle daddle. <laughs> Dope. Say what you like. Yeah. I like him. Yeah, it's kind of <laughs> dull as water. Say it's me. It's me. Gobble, gobble, D. It's me. It's me. Old gobble, gobble, B. Oh, oh. Uh, uh, uh. Howard, you're funny. But he's funny too. Yeah. Different styles. Different styles. <laughs> Apples, oranges. Apples and pears. You can't and compare. Dullard. <laughs> Witless. All right, let's uh, take a break. Yeah, J Jackie's going to make Tom funny. I want to see that. No competition to you. I don't understand. What was that movie with Marilyn Monroe and and uh, Eve Saint? Eve Montan. Eve Montan <laughs> wants a win over. 
Marilyn Monroe is a rich guy, but he has no comedy sense, and they hire Milton Berle to teach him comedy. <laughs> Did you ever see that movie yeah. with Marilyn Monroe? I can't remember the name of that stupid movie. Called the Tom Chiasano story. <laughs> Some like it's funny. Some like it's funny. <laughs> Very good. Okay, let's take a break. We'll be back right after.